What's up Sneaker Fan? In today's video I'll be doing a special review, as it is Easter, on a few Air Jordans that are Easter themed. Some of you guys might be sat there thinking, these aren't Easter sneakers, but in my opinion they are. They're colourful, they're to do with Bugs Bunny, Looney Tunes, Space Jam, etc. I've always loved Bugs Bunny and Looney Tunes as a kid, so this review is going to be very exciting for me. Before we get into the review, I'm going to be doing a giveaway to a special viewer. Simple rules. Throughout the whole of the review, from the intro all the way to the outro, this easter egg will pop up in the video for 5 seconds. If you see it, you have to comment, hashtag easter egg found, at the time it was found. So for example, if the easter egg pops up at 1 minute 52, you've got to write hashtag easter egg found at 1 minute 52 to 1 minute 57. Pretty easy, eh? But there is only one winner. And that winner will be the one that comments first. I'll be able to tell because it will be on the comments first comment. The winner will receive these pack of stickers posted out to wherever you are, all free of charge. It's nothing special, it's just a bit of fun on Easter. Good luck. I've also dressed Easter themed myself. I've got my Bugs Bunny snapback on and I've got my Hair Kicks on Fire tee on. Let's get into that review. So I'll be kicking off this Easter review with the, the Air Jordan 8 Bugs Bunny. I'll start off with the box like I always do in my reviews. I say that every time as well. Uh, these are going to be a quick review on each of these. I've got five pairs to go through, so I won't be taking all your time up. So let's start with a review on these, starting off with the box. It's your original Air Jordan box with the black with the white jump man on there. On the label it reads Air Jordan 8 Retro White Black Slash True Red UK 10. These come out on April 20th, 2013 for $160. That's the box. Getting into the shoe. Quick review, these have got a soft tumble leather going around. These are, these are really nice. These are one of my, my favourite um, Looney Tunes shoes, as I call them, because they're really bulky and I love bulky Jordans. Um, like my sixes, I love my sixes and they're really bulky. So these are really, really nice. These have got the white leather going all the way around. This is my first pair of Jordan 8s as well. Sorry, I keep on interrupting it. It's got this grey suede going all the way around with your Air Jordan Velcro straps with it, um, that's also suede, sorry. On the tongue it's got this carpet effect with the Jumpman. It's in red, white and dark grey. It's got this pattern going all the way around the side, different colours. And then it's got your grey, red and white midsole. It's got a white sole with a black jump man and that red and grey and white pattern again in the middle. It's got these, look, so these are my first, uh, first pair of eight, so these straps are quite dope that go underneath the lace, that go on top of the laces, sorry. It's got the 23 on the top there. It's got your jump man in red on the inside. These are real comfortable as well, real, real comfortable, real big and bulky. So they're the Bugs Bunny 8s. Getting into the Air Jordan Retro 7 hairs. The 30th anniversary box, gold jump man, gold 23 on the front there. The label reads Air Jordan 7 Retro, white slash true red slash light silver slash trim. These come out on 16th of May 2015 for $160 or so. So that's the box. Getting into the shoe. These are a bit like the Year of the Rabbits that I'm about to show you as well. Uh, they've got this nice nubuck suede going all on the toe box around the side in that pale greyish colour and with your tough white leather going all the way around the top it's got your red and white midsole on the bottom it's got the multicoloured sole with your white and your red, your green, your orange, your black your purple jump man on the heel there it's also got your red jump man on the suede bit on the, on the side it's got your black pull tab 23 in purple on the back in that triangle. It's got white laces and it's got Air Jordan on the tongue, also with the same sole colours, all multi coloured going around the tongue. It's got Nike Air in black on the inside with this red, nice material going around. So the Air Jordan 7 hairs, real nice shoe. Getting into the hair ones with the box again. It's got 30th anniversary box with your gold jump man. On the tag it reads Air Jordan 1 Mid WB, guessing Warner Brothers. Uh, the colourway is white slash true red slash light silver slash black. 
These come out on the 4th of April 2015 for $125. So, getting into the shoe. These are basically like the Hair 7s, but obviously in a 1. Um, it's got the same suede nubuck going around the sides. It's got this hard white leather going all the way around with the swoosh. It's got a stitched Air Jordan in red, which is quite a dope feature on these ones. Um, stitching instead of like printed or whatever they use. It's got your black jump man on the top and it's also got hair in yellow in a funky font on the back tab there. It's got your all red sole, white laces, um, multi-coloured tongue again, same with the hair, sevens. And then it's got your hair jump man with your hair writing on it, which is quite smart, which I like what we did on that. Inside again it's got that red nice padded feeling. Got your black jump man also on the inside there. So yeah, these are the hair, the, the hair ones. Getting into the year, the rabbit sevens. Starting off with the box again. This is a complete different box. It's all red with this gold pattern going all over it with the jump man in the middle there. It's a Chinese themed pattern, as these are year of the rabbits. On the label, it's got Air Jordan Seven Retro Year of the Rabbit. The colourway is light silver slash metallic gold slash true red slash white. And it's a pull out drawer one. So like the box sets that you can get. It's got your gold rim there. And then on that tag on the inside, in Chinese writing I found out it says it means year of the rabbit. These come out on the 1st of May 2011 in Asia and then 7th of May 2011 stateside. We have two different dates for these to release. And they release for $160. So that's the box. Getting into the shoe. These also are exactly the same as the Hair 7s and the Hair 1s, but there's just a bit of different touches on it. It's got the same pale nubuck suede going around the sides with your hard, tough white leather. The quality on these are much better than the Hair 7s, in my opinion. On the sole, it's got your white, your red, and your gold, with your gold jump man on the heel there, so there's a bit of a different from the 7s. Uh, on the side it's got your gold stitch jump man instead of the red one. The midsole is just red and white. These came with your gold laces and an all red tongue with your Air Jordan in gold and white. On the back it's got a gold pool tag and your gold 23. On the inside it's got that red padding again. But it's got your gold jump man on the bottom. And it's also on the inside of the tongue it's got this stamp. Gold stamp with your jump man on it. Which is a bit of a different feature. And then on the um, cardboard pullouts, it's got the size and the Japanese logo, that uh, Chinese logo, sorry, not Japanese. And different features on these. They're the year of the Rabbit 7s. So getting into the Air Jordan 5 Space Jams, comes in your Jordan 5, Jordan 6 box. It's got your red jump man on the top there, it's got your red jump man there on the side, and it's got that cement effect again going around. On the label it says Air Jordan 5 Retro, white slash infrared 23 slash poison green slash black. These come out on the 6th of June 2015 for $190. That's the box. Getting into the shoe. I actually camped out for these ones at my local Foot Locker as well. There was not a queue whatsoever, so I got my pair straight away. So these are one of my favourite fives because they're real colourful. It's got this all white upper in the tough leather. It's got your poison green with your light grey and your infrared 23 with your black on the midsole. On the sole it's black with your translucent clear sole with your infrared jump man on the bottom. It's got your infrared jump man on the back there. It's got this black mesh going around the sides and under the laces. It's got your white laces with your black and clear lace lock. It's got that cement effect on the tongue with your infrared jump man, and these are 3M, this, this tongue. On the inside of the tongue, it's got your Air Jordan and Infrared 23 on this white material, and it's got the 30th anniversary logo on the bottom of the shoe. So they're the Air Jordan 5 Space Jams. Last but not least, the Air Jordan Spizz Oak Space Jams. Comes in your 30th anniversary box again with your gold jump man and your gold 23. On the label it just says Jordan Spizzy and the colourway is white slash light poison green slash university red slash GR. 
These come out on the 24th of June 2015 for $175. So that's the box. Getting into the shoe. Also, these are another one of my favourite out of the Easter collection, as well as the Space Jam 5s, because these are also very colourful. Again, Spizikes, all different types of Jordan models all put into one shoe with Mr. Spike Lee himself. So these are all white upper, soft, it's not hard upper, this is a soft one with various colours. It's got the elephant print going around the side, it's got this black midsole with this green, the light green, the poison green, sorry, speckles all over it. And then it's got your white midsole, and then on the sole, it's got your poison green, red and purple on the bottom and then it's got your red with your poison green speckles on the lace pool tabs with your poison green pool tab bits as well it's got this purple mesh going round with your with your white laces your red with your poison green jump man stitch poison green lace lock red tongue light mist silver uh, padded that's nice and nice and soft in there. It's got your red insole with your 30th third, third anniversary in poison green on the bottom there. Purple pool tag and then your red or pink Brooklyn on the back there. So they're Jordan Spizz like Space Jams. So there we have it, the review's finished. Like I said it was a very quick review because I didn't want to take up most of your time as I went through a lot of pairs of Jordans. So I just did a quick overview of all of them. Hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, remember, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Hope that winner found that Easter egg throughout the video. If you did, remember to comment down below, hashtag Easter egg, and then the time it was found till the time it ended, so the five second mark. And I'll find out that winner uh, shortly. Please don't forget to subscribe as well, if you haven't subscribed already. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, at KingofVI. And until next time, peace.